a couple of warm days over to you. Hey, good morning. And uh, luckily, at least some of it for us is going to be happening uh, over the weekend. I know into next week as well, but we'll have to look into next week too. I'm sure we'll have plenty of traffic updates as well. So uh, we'll get there when we get to next week, but hopefully you can enjoy a nice calm weekend. I do want to take you up to two big problems. This one is really going to slow you down on the 15 southbound. It's now also affecting the 138 too. Uh, this could cause delays over an hour for you. So this was supposed to reopen by about 5.15. We've not received an update yet. We're still waiting for one. So just a heads up, if you travel toward the Cajon Pass, we have two lanes that are blocked off due to a bad accident that happened earlier, and we just don't have that update quite yet. If you can hold off on heading out because you're just going to be sitting in that traffic, if you have an alternate you could take, uh, I would definitely suggest doing so, but there are, are a lack of alternates in that area. All right, we also have a full freeway shutdown in Costa Mesa on the 405 southbound due to some police activity. We unfortunately had a fatal accident here overnight. It's right at Harbor Boulevard. We don't know when it will reopen. You won't be able to get through it, so you're going to have to divert around just a little bit of traffic there, but you do have other options to take to get around this area. If you have to travel into Orange County, the 5 or the 55 right now is going to be your best shot. Quick look at real-time traffic traveling through downtown LA along the 10 and the 110 interchange. Everything's moving smoothly here. All right, a lot going on. Those are two big problems. John Irene will have another check in just a bit. All right, Emma, thank you.